Hi, I'm Ben with Town & Country Environmental Pest Solutions. Today I want to talk about grey squirrels, some of the damage they can cause and one of the methods we've got to control them. So the grey squirrels in, in the garden have been on the bird feeders and ripping them apart. This is just a, a cheap bird feeder but you can see they just get on the feeding ports and it takes them literally seconds just to rip these apart and destroy the feeders. Um, there are squirrel proof offerings on the market. This is one of them but the thing is with these I find it dissuades the birds a little bit and the bigger birds like the woodpeckers that we enjoy seeing can't get on them. Also this one even though it's squirrel proof it's been knocked down at some point by the squirrels that smashed the inside. So the method we're going to use to trap this squirrel in the garden we're going to use live trapping. The advantages of live trapping is that if you catch any non-target species by accident it can easily be re-released. So this is the live cage trap that we're going to use. A spring-loaded door with a treadle plate. Once the treadle plate gets triggered, the door is going to slam behind the squirrel. So what we're going to do is just bait it behind the treadle plate and a small trail of, of peanuts leading up, and try and get it to get it to feed in here. I'll put this under its natural feeding source, which is the peanut feeder at the minute. Let it get used to it, and then I'll remove the peanut feeder and leave this as its only food source. So we're going to set this now on top of the shed and see how we get on. been watching this squirrel on the bird feeder this morning. I've had a trap out for a while. He's been eating the peanuts from the feeder above the trap. And he's quite confident what I've just done is taken the peanut feeder down and tipped a load of peanuts into the trap and he's now going round and eating all the ones that he can reach from the outside. I think it's not going to be too long now before he has to go in and it'll get trapped. Okay, a couple of days after we're filming on the feeders, we've got this grey squirrel in the live catch trap. So in accordance with the law, this can't be re-released, so it's going to be humanely dispatched now. If you have problems with grey squirrels, this is just one of the trapping methods we can use. Find us at www.tcepestsolutions.co.uk.